We're gonna go meet James Courier, who is our seed round investor. And then we're gonna talk about language. And language is really important because it's the first thing that people see uh, when they come in contact with your brand. When you go to a website, like say Uber, it says go anywhere. And that immediately anchors the thought that this company is associated with allowing you to be able to go anywhere. If a company or if a prospect or a customer tries to come to your website and they can't buy into the vision of what you're trying to solve or even the problem of what you're solving in the first place, then they're not even gonna try your product out. And in that case, what's the point? Having the right language, that is your product to get people to buy in and go to that next step. Here we are, gonna try to master language. I'll just pass it actually. And uh, NFX. You know, do they want to see you creating a category? That's like secret sauce stuff. Two hours later. You better make a fuck ton of money for me. I'm just kidding. Uh. That's right. One of the examples was at a company called Tickle, like I mentioned before. He came up with a phrase called Me Media. And that was the phrase he stuck with. That's the phrase he marketed with. Then the press caught on and they recategorized his company as user generated content. Eventually when the world caught on, they recategorized again and made this thing, gave it a name called social media. And so that became the category name and that's what stuck. And we could finally give a name to this thing that people didn't really understand in the past. We're gonna go do some research into our competitors, especially the biggest ones who received the most funding, who definitely had lots of press releases can go through all the language, find all the names of categories, all the phrases being used to describe the product and the problem, put it into a word map and see what we can uh, mix and match to come out with something unique that will stick in people's minds. So we'll see, stay tuned.